check the mic and make sure it sound right, boys. What's good, gang? I am back. Uh, I know I'm looking like yesterday, but today is still the same day. This is my second load. Um, I just wanted to come real quick, do a quick video or whatever. Um, I got everything hooked up already. Uh, I'm loading my, well, unloading my diesel right now. Um, what I got, 1,500 diesel and 70,000 no lead. Um, I just wanted to show you what is called the Vita route, which is the, um, which is the, um, hold on, gotta switch it around, sorry. All right, so I wanted to show you the Vita route, which is the fuel report or whatever. So you see the unleaded right here, the unleaded two down there and the diesel. Um, I'm, I don't have super on my truck, so they have two unleaded tanks or whatever. So um, the volume, that's how much is in that tank, 1,240, um, that's what's in there before I loaded it. Um, the second tank, 1,021, and the diesel has 2,970 in it, um, and I get another printout when I'm done that shows how much is in there after. Um, what I was telling y'all about the store I couldn't unload, the water volume, that shows how much water is in the ground, like when it rains or whatever, and why y'all getting um, watered down fuel or whatever. But they only have seven gallons, so that's okay. That's not a lot. But that other store, I think they had 100 gallons of water in the no lead and 45 gallons in the super, and that couldn't happen. So yeah, that's that. Um, so yeah, again on the water thing, um, how we basically, we go off the, we look at the Vita route or whatever for the water and also we stick the tank. But we have, I think I have that paste in this truck. It's like a pink paste we put on there and we put it on the stick. I hope it's still in there if ain't nobody took it out. I don't know what <laughs> I think it's in the other truck but it's a pink paste we put on the end of the stick we smear it about seven to eight inches up or whatever and we stick it in a tank if it turns purple um up to a certain amount of inches i guess how many other inches we put on there with the paste then that's too much water which basically what happened at that one store yesterday so yeah that's basically it that's why y'all be getting watered down gas so let me finish dropping this off I'll be back. All right, so I got my no leg going now. Um, I have to pay close attention at this store because the no lead tank over there that I have to load next, it pressures up so it can spill all over the parking lot or whatever. So I really got to pay attention. So um, I have to put most of the no lead in this tank. So I got to put 2950 and 1100 in this tank and just the 2950 in that tank since it pressures up or whatever so yeah that's about it after this i could probably get in about two more loads hopefully in my day i'm off for the next two days so uh i won't upload i won't upload this video well this will be two videos or whatever so uh, Sunday and Monday, I'll have a video. Maybe, maybe uh, Tuesday, Wednesday, too. I'm not sure, but don't hold me on that Tuesday, Wednesday. Definitely uh, Sunday and Monday, though. Y'all, too much longer. We gotta get this paperwork done while this is offloading. So, yeah, y'all stay tuned. I'll be right back. All right, y'all, while this, um, this last no lead compartment is unloading on this tank, I'm gonna go ahead and stick the other tank while I'm waiting on this one. See where it's at. This is the one that presses up. So, go ahead and stick it. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
So that tank is at 29 inches of fuel. So let's compare that to our beater. says 21 inches so it's a few inches off so this next tank i mean this uh tank right here is done offloading so i'm gonna uh, clear the hose a little bit and switch it to that last compartment and that last uh tank right there All right, so as you can see, the hose is not gonna reach like I thought it would, so I'm gonna have to back the trailer back just a little bit. But I'm gonna go ahead and stick this tank, see where it's at, close it up, and go from there. down where the compartments are um the trailer will not move if that bar is up so you got to put it down if you're trying to move the truck and trailer or whatever all right so let me move back
paperwork um, before I started loading these paints with the 29 inches and after 64.5 with this one. So what I did was my drop gun, which is the thing that's, y'all should notice by now, which is the thing that's hooked to the ground, to the hose. Um, I left it, I didn't open it all the way. I left it cracked just a little bit. Uh, that'll help with the pressure and up. But I get back with y'all. I got to watch this. Everything is done. So let's go put everything up, gang. for this video make sure y'all like share subscribe uh to my channel comment 
do whatever you want to do if you like to. I ain't forced you, I ain't put a gun to your head. Anyway, I'm about to go here, and give me something to drink, uh, get this beetle root, and head out of here. Thanks for watching. <laughs>